If you were to give your 15-year-old self an advice, what would it be? Don't be afraid to make mistakes, but also don't um, but also don't forget to live within the parameters that God and your parents have put there for you. Because sometimes I feel like when you're young, you think that rules and parameters were put there because people don't want you to have fun or because they're trying to keep the joy out of your life. But honestly, those parameters were put to protect you and to make you grow into the woman that you're supposed to be. So live within those parameters, but at the same time, don't be afraid to go on adventures and try out new things. Saka huwag masyara matayos yung ulo mo, girl. Masyara ako masakit sa ulo. Hindi ka Hindi ka mauwi sa bahay. Nagbabanda-banda ka lang. Tapos nag-boyfriend ka. Galingan mo naman, girl. What do you want to say? Ayan. Um, well, and that's really difficult because I work closely with World Vision Philippines. So I really would want to champion um, the welfare, the education, the protection of children, especially children in off-grid communities. And the development, a sustainable development of Filipino families all over the Philippines. Yes. We believe in World Vision that children deserve to be taken care of, to be provided with basic needs like clean water, food, and of course education. The second will have to be, I want to be able to start meaningful conversations with young men and women about um, purpose, about um, really finding out what what you can do substantial things that you can do with your life to become a better part of the community that you belong in. what's your advice to millennials wow good job um well it, it really honestly depends on what aspect of a millennial's life we're talking about so if just in general, what advice would I give to people my age? Millennial din po ako, 93. 25 years um, old. Yes. Um, I would probably say that you have to work hard. More than anything, you have to learn how to work hard and to work smart. And one way to really get to do that is to excel in whatever field God has put you in, whatever field that you're in. And to be able to do that, you must be able to learn from people. Kailangan hindi ka nagpapatalo ka agad na halimbawa napagalitan ka lang or nagkamali ka, magigive up ka na kaagad dun sa work na meron ka or sa team na part ka. So learn to be gritty, to be passionate about the work that you do and at the same time, be professional and have incredible work ethic. Another thing, maybe just in general, general, the most important thing that you really have to take care of is your moral values. Mm -hmm. You must have like a compass that you follow. Kasi mm -hmm. madaling masway in all sorts of directions pag hindi mo alam kung ano yung mga bagay na pinaninindigan mo at yung mga bagay na ayaw mo at gusto mo at ikabubuti mo at ng mga tao sa paligid mo. So, once you know your moral values, your core values, it's easier to make decisions because you have a point of reference every single time. Hindi ka kayang bilhin ng ng buyo ng mga kaibigan mo or ng sweldo lang na mataas. Mm -hmm.